for a thousand years. The hills fill my heart with the sound of music. My heart wants to sing every song that it hears. It was mainly all about the songs when I was a kid. So actually, Visiting Maria as a character is a bit of a new phenomenon, which is good. Um, but yeah, I do know it pretty well. I think most people do, right? You know, it's it's. Um, I, I have a weird, innate distrust of anyone that doesn't really know the sound of music. Um, the sound of music, Ferris Bueller's Day Off, and Seinfeld are kind of my three, you know, judgments of a human being. So, um, how to make a well-rounded human. My heart wants to beat like the wings of a bird that flies from the lake to the trees. My heart wants to sigh like a chime that flies from the church on a breeze. To laugh like a brook when it trips and falls over stones on its way. I love singing that style more and more. Um, and so I've been working really hard on that transition into legit singing and, um, and it's so rewarding and it feels, it is like learning an instrument again. It's have, it has that full, it's less about that kind of gut belt instinct and more about the, the dynamics and, uh, and, and technique and, the, and also placement and text and all those sorts of things that sometimes with the pop style, you, you know, it's not necessarily about because we want a quality of sound, whereas with this sort of stuff you can just really soar and flesh those words out and they're great words. So um, I'm really enjoying this direction and um, it is making my heart really happy. <laughs> she has an extraordinary voice and she is going to be the lady that is going to sing Rogers and the Hammersteins, one of their greatest songs, and that's of course, Climb Every Mountain. Ladies and gentlemen, playing the Mother Abbess is the wonderful Jackie Dark. I started in musicals, so um, I fell into opera by mistake when someone in musicals said, oh, you've got you know, a voice that could sing opera, and um, I'd, I had never come across it until I sang opera, I hadn't heard opera. Um, and of course I love that now, I, I love opera, but um, I, my first love was musicals, that's where I started and I heard Sweeney Todd that a friend introduced me to and I, it blew my mind, I just thought this is, it, you know, it just, it was like it invaded my whole body and I, I just thought I have to sing this stuff and um, so yeah, it, it's, it's incredible to, to actually be getting the chance to do that. To sing uh, Climb Every Mountain, which is, you know, a, one of the best songs ever written and the most iconic song in show business really, mm. one of, um, is incredibly exciting and I've just met the cast out the back and they're all so warm and gorgeous and that's exciting too, to, to be a part of that little family. And I suppose after you've done, you know, Aida on the Harbour in <laughs> torrential rains, yeah. not much I mean, we did. I did three Umneruses a week and that role, you just sing and sing and sing. So um, yes, and uh, like doing, doing a show inside in air conditioning um, without the wind tossing me around and, and the rain, <laughs> it will be a nice luxury, I think. <laughs> when you read the script, the character is really well written, really well drawn. She is a full person and so it does inform itself very well. You don't have to really, you come to it as, you know, I'll come to it as Amy and find the Maria in there and I think you can, I can trust that process because it is a beautiful role. Rodgers and Hammerstein really did a beautiful job with this show.